and me We meant to be In the great outdoors Forever free I've got, got something in my eye. Oh, there you go. That's all right now. Well, I'm back out in Rochdale and I think this is going to be my last group dig till this corona thing's over because people can't be together, can they? So I'm coming out and I'm in Rochdale. Last time I was here, I found five silvers and somebody found a Queen Anne silver, which was 1700. I've never seen one before. So that's what I fancy today. And someone found an ammy up there. Now the wind's a bit brutal in parts and other parts where it's shady like this, it's not too bad. So I'm going to try and uh, keep out of the wind, unless it's a good signal, obviously, and then I'll just have to dig it up. So I'll see you soon. <laughs> it's absolutely brutal up here, the wind, but first find looks like a poor man's ring. That's all right, isn't it? Poor man's ring. Copper ring, because they would have had copper rings if they were very poor. It's not too long. It's not too long. Oh, oh God, I don't we can hear you. There it is. Oh, it's George VI. Fifth, six. George VI. Got a little tiny little stud. I just keep finding tiny things. But that's because I'm trying to find hammies, you see. So I'm digging up loads small and low signal. Oh! Oh no, I'm not going to find that now with my eyes, am I? I scared myself then. Just found a dead bone. Ugh. It's a bit of gold wire. Not got anything good yet. But the wind's dropping as I'm getting down the hill. Started up there, you see, it was like whipping my face off. But um, I'm going down there now, it shouldn't be as bad. What you gonna be? What you gonna be? Oh, what you gonna be for Donny? You be a hammy. Oh, it's tiny that. Oh, it's a button. It's a button. Where there's buttons, there was Queen Anne Silver, weren't there? Because that's what I'm after today, a bit of Queen Anne Silver. I'm definitely gonna find some. God. Oh. Oh, look! Oh, what? <laughs> be Queen Anne, be Queen Anne! No, it's George V, George V, George V! Bit of silver in the hole! What year is it? If it's before 1920, it's silver! Oh, fantastic! Oh, brilliant! I say started now. Started. I can't see what the date is. Oh, fantastic! <laughs> Bingo, jingo! 1920, so it will be silver. George V, sixpence. <laughs> Not Queen Anne, but I don't care. I don't care. I don't care get about beat up by wind. I don't care about anything. Because I'm off now till who knows? I don't know when I'm off till. Could be September. I'm going to make videos all the time. I'll update you on that in a bit. <laughs> Found a bit of a patch out of the wind and I've just found a little wren farthing. Can you see the little bird on it? Oh no, that's George the Six, he's not a little bird. There it is, little wren farthing. I like them. They're cute, them, but them ones. I like them ones. It was low that, it was only a 60. It was a 60 signal, but it was very strong. I thought this was definitely a cartwheel penny, which just turns out to be a screw thingy in a block. I think it's probably off that. Right underneath it, but at least I'm not getting any uh, interference. This has got to be, this has got to be the hardest thing that, to find ever. It's just there in that corner. Oh, quite small, isn't it? Don't, don't drop it, Dad. Don't drop it. 
おいしいおいしいおいしいおいしい I'm going to have to, I'm scared of dropping it, it's so minutely small. Can you see how small it is? That's the smallest thing in the, in the planet of small, but it's perfectly round and formed. Oh, can you see anything? Do I need to get glasses on? Because at this minute in time, it's Roman gold. And it's a little tiny Roman gold in my head. It's probably not. Can you see anything? I'm scared of dropping it. That's a big musket ball. It's very ashy down there. It makes me think it might have been a, a midden or a fire or something. Yeah. Get okay, out of the wind. Yeah, big musket ball. It's massive as well. I've been going around for ages. I haven't found that much yet. But I still had one sixpence. I haven't that'll do. But it doesn't really matter because I'm off work now until who knows when. Could be September. Will's going to be in a right mess. Now I've come up with a solution for the government. Well, not for the government really, but all these companies, you know, that have been making millions off us for years, you know, like Sky and that, they should all, you know, step up to the market and say to everybody, look, you can have your Sky free for three months. And Gas and Electric should say you can have free Gas and Electric for three months. And the phone, you know, mobiles, because if you're isolated, people need to speak to each other on the phone, don't they? So all them companies should like give a bit back now. Time to give back, isn't it? But anyway, I, I don't know when I'm going back to work. Could be any time. It could be like September. So that means I'll be off in my April, May, June, July. Oh, six months. Be off six months. So I've decided to do something. I'll tell you about that in a minute. That's the George III. I'm just very close to where all these old buildings have been. So I, I thought it was silver at first, but will be in a minute. I don't know what this is, but it looks like it's got a pattern on it, doesn't it? See it? It's like hollow in that side. And then that side looks like it's a, a lid of some sort. Or it's definitely something that, isn't it? I don't like it. Now, I'm coming down the back of this house here now. This house was very old and I walk past here with my dog all the time so I've weighed this area up and I think it's got potential to have Queen Anne silver or at least George III silver. Yeah, I like that. I don't know what that is. It's a bit of lead with it and it says WAD on it. Now, if it'd have had an N on it, it'd have said Dawn, wouldn't it? <laughs> I don't know what that is. We'll just have to call it a wad of lead, a lead wad. Right, I don't know if it's back in the wind here, but there's a nice signal. Is that it? A buckle, something. Something down there, I can see it. Oh, is it just a bit of her? Uh... Is that a bit of wire? Can't get it out. Oh, there it is. Bit, bit, oh, it's definitely copper, isn't it? Look at the colour on it. That well. Now, while I'm off, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and make everybody as cheerful as they possibly can. Because I know it's not at the minute, you turn on the news and it's coronavirus. So you look on Facebook, it's coronavirus. So I'm not mentioning it again after this moment. But instead, I'm going to make as many videos as I can. I'm going to do live streams, quizzes, uh, and just everything that can be cheerful so but it's, this is your chance now you need to if you've not rung that little bell and subscribed you need to because digger dawn tuesday seven o'clock now is out the window i'm just going to make videos as and when so they're just going to appear anytime so you really need to click that little bell so that you get notifications and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed because otherwise you'll miss them and you don't know what could be happening it could be singing could be cooking could be doing a quiz, could be doing coin cleaning, could be doing anything. So, uh, and I'm going to try and do one every day as well. I mean, it's a big one, that. I don't know if I can do one every day for six months, but I'll give it a go. Hey, look, spoon in the hole. I've not found a spoon for ages. Is it a full spoon or is it half a spoon? Oh, it's a full spoon. Oh, well, hey. Hey, look, 
I've got something to stir my drinks with now. I can, I can polish that up, use it. I like using things I've found. You know, even if they are a bit cruddy, you can always clean them, can't you? A hey, spoon in the hole, spoon in the hole. Oh, is that white thing or is it? It's definitely that. Oh, it's not silver. Silver won't be that white, would it? I've seen white silver before, you see. Is it? Oh, no, it's... Um, shut up. It's a big sort of drawer handle thingy, I think. Yeah, it's, some, it's off a drawer handle. I've seen them before. They have a, like a pattern around the edge with a bit of enamel in the middle. Yeah, it's, a, it's off a door knob or a, a drawer knob. We're just trying to decide how to get across that little river. I mean, it doesn't look bad, but it's quite deep. I'm thinking of trying to swing across there with them branches. <laughs> just want to get over there. Well, it's nearly time to go home now, but not as sad like I usually am, because usually I'm going home and it's a week before I can come out. I might be out tomorrow. In fact, I probably will be. <laughs> so, Diggy, dig, 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 see you soon, a lot sooner than usual. And like I say, keep an eye out because the video's going to be popping up everywhere. Yeah, dig a dawn on fire. <laughs> see you soon, keep safe and keep well. And remember, don't buy any toilet rolls and, uh, or, or anything like that because you don't need it. Like a bird on a tree